print email Facebook Twitter more Bureau of Meteorology impacted by internet service providers move to wireless frequency the Bureau of Meteorology's BOM ability to accurately measure the weather could be affected by plans to move some wireless internet service providers onto its radar frequency the bomb has warned that changes to the radio frequency it operates on the 5.6 gigahertz band could cause problems with its radar systems range resolution and measurement accuracy Dr. Konstanty Bielkowski, an expert on radar systems from the University of Queensland, said the 5.6 GHz was good at interactions with water content, in terms of reflectivity and water absorption, and because of that it's able to detect rain particles and rain and things like that, he said. The new 5G mobile network needs a frequency band to operate on and the federal government is planning to auction off parts of the 3.6 GHz band for it in October. But already using that band are a number of wireless internet service providers, which need a new home. The Australian Communications and Media Authority ACMA, has proposed moving them to the 5.6 GHz band, which is already used by the bomb. In a statement the bomb said it was working with ACMA to resolve any potential issues of interference. Dr. Bielkowski said interference came into play because of leakage. The issue is that signals, when they operate in a band, also have a leakage in an adjacent spectrum, he said. The leakage occurs because when we create a signal, it actually has a very wide spectrum, and we use filters to limit the out-of-band signals which occur. You can never get that down to zero, it always will exist. That signal, although it is not that strong compared to a signal of interest is actually quite strong compared to the level of signal expected from far away rain particles. Dr. Bielkowski said it could be as extreme as storms appearing on the radar, even if they did not exist. Effectively it could look like a false return, so maybe rain occurring where the operator is actually using their antenna, he said. And it could be a very strong one, which would give a very false impression that some sort of storm was occurring where in reality nothing was actually occurring there at all. Print email Facebook Twitter